Go get the money, go get the money. Go get the money, go get the money. Go get the money. Okay, fast car. y'all welcome back to another vlog my name is Aviana Latisse and me and my husband just built a semi custom new build from the ground up and we have slowly been surely decorating it room by room with vlog by vlog if you are interested in any lifestyle home decor blended family content make sure you hit that subscribe button turn those notifications on so you never miss an upload and if you are on Instagram you can follow me over there at Aviana Latisse so um first off I want to say I got a new truck because my husband is obsessed <laughs> and so if you know if you follow me on Instagram you'll see my rants on my husband getting new vehicles every time he steps into a dealership it, it's bad y'all me and Debbie out in the streets catch y'all when I see y'all pour one out for all my dead homies Push it, 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 push it. Go get the money, go get the money, go, go get the money, go get the money. I was back to the street. Hurt me. Y'all, look at my hair. <laughs> Hold on, I need to go to the bathroom and fix this bun. Cause I don't feel like doing my hair. All right, I did this messy bun because I don't feel like doing nothing else. Anyways. Um, all the stores were closed yesterday because I totally forgot that it was Sunday. So me and Gabby, we didn't go to no stores. So today I am going to some stores. Um, I'm excited because Crate and Barrel uh, scheduled our delivery for the media console, which will be here um, Friday. So that gets delivered. And then I was on Crate and Barrel earlier and I really think that, I know I gave y'all my timeline in which I want a lot of this stuff to be done, but the last video, why is it dark? The last video that I did when I was, when I got the chairs, um, a lot of people was telling me how I should rearrange my gathering room so that it feels um, bigger. And I 100% agree. I don't know why it's dark. I 100% agree with how they said that I should have maneuvered this around here. I'll flip you guys around. Do not mind my junkie home. So, <laughs> um, one person said that the TV should have went on that wall. And the couch should have went from here to here. And then another person said that... I could have left the TV here, took this away and left it right here. And so that way a chair will be over there, a chair will be over there. The windows will open it with the window treatment. I loved every idea. However, you know, I take my chances in which the battles that I have with my husband when it comes to <laughs> certain things. So moving that TV over there is going to be a big fuss so another thing that i did convince him to because i'm i'm sick of this i'm sick of the gathering room i'm ready to be comfortable in here and get this out of the way so i can focus upstairs is that this carpet has to go and i think that that's what's throwing me off because i really want a nice rug but it's hard because not only do i have to take the rug the rug the carpet color into consideration um, my couch, the chairs, and the media console colors I have to take into consideration when it comes to a rug. So I am going to get the people to come and just make all of this carpet, make it all hardwood. So at least that part will, at least that part will open, make it feel bigger, I guess, or make me like the space more. So. That is one thing that I will say that he agreed on, even though he told me he don't want to pay for it. I'm like, that's why I got money. That's why I work. I got it. Don't worry about it, sweetheart. Don't worry about it, sweetheart. So uh, <laughs> I'm going to pay for them to do it because I don't think that it will cost that much because one, 
they have extra flooring for our house downstairs. My lashes is, ooh. They have extra flooring for our, um, that they put up here downstairs that they left in the basement. So I'm gonna see that. And then when I went on Shaw floors, the box they have our floor cut kind at like Lowe's at Home Depot. So it is easy for me to go into store to go get some boxes of it. And then if I ever need more or if I need to return some, I can do that. So I don't think it will cost us that much. If it's me not getting a Chanel bag or a Chanel bag or my YSL bag for my floors, I take it, and that's that's just where I'm at with it. So um, that is an update that I have for the gathering room because I know y'all sick and tired of being sick and tired and being sick and tired of seeing this goddamn room and ain't nothing happening but me cleaning up shit that Gabby did messed up and wrote on the table. Speaking of that table, that table I know for certain I am putting it in the sunroom like. It's going there. I think I want to bring out um, some uh, these earth tone colors that I have going in here. And um, I want round, I don't want oval. So I've been looking at that. I've been looking at that, the coffee table, the condenser for over here. And then I'm ready to get rid of this uh, table as well and do my round table of 50, 58 inch is what I measured that will hold six seats so those are the three items that i plan on purchasing very soon <laughs> i know for a fact that i am purchasing the uh media console over here in the cafe area um pretty soon and try to see if i can get them to come out and fix that little wire thing that that's underneath there so it won't show because we didn't know that the uh frame tvs had a box so we didn't do the same like how y'all see that it ain't no wire right there because it all comes down right here well we didn't do that let me see if i can zoom in we didn't do that for this tv over here if you can see that wire right there because all we did was just a plug up there we didn't bring, have him break it down and do it at the bottom so that is the only thing that i will have to fix but that's minor so right now i'm about to order it I'm, oh the table the round table that i'm looking to replace over here is our house it's the one i found over there and i know editing me depending on how i feel probably won't insert a picture of it i do need to order the patio i mean the the porch furniture since we are not getting our deck and patio built so and i also need to order the boys wallpaper because i didn't do that so i'm about to do that right now and then i come back here and talk to y'all i might talk to y'all in the car because i want to go get that espresso why would y'all why y'all had me wear them quirky glasses in the beginning of this video y'all ain't right i'm on my way to go get that espresso finally from best buy because i want to try it this week because i'm tired of buying coffee i'm tired of spending money i'm tired of, i'm just tired and i'm tired of that keurig i don't even like it no more i don't know what's up with me but i don't like it that's my husband's so i'm gonna get the espresso and try that and see if it's worth the hype i should say but I do want to try it. So I'm going to Best Buy and I also want to get the gimbal or the tripod thing that you hold, handheld tripod for Sony, the compatible one, the Bluetooth compatible one. So I want to get that as well. So that is what I'm going to grab from Best Buy. I'm trying to, to her, hold off the urge of buy, buying another Dyson because we have one it's the core one but we do have a cordless one but i think it's gone like it's done we we've used it at its max capable capability of the years in which it needed to be used but i'm tired of moving at um dyson up and down these damn steps i need one for downstairs and i need one for upstairs mainly i want the big one to be upstairs because everything is carpet upstairs and then i'll have the cordless one for downstairs because semi carpet mostly hardwood dysons are good with hardwood so that is that and yeah if i find an open box one then i might grab that too so i'm out here bumming it out 
looking real cute, bowing it out. I got the Miss Russell. I don't know if it's the one that Janae got, but we gonna see. I think really what I wanted it for is to try their coffee pods, basically. Like their Nespresso pods. Because when, I don't know if I'm just fat or greedy, but when she came in off the flavors that they offer, I was like, yeah. I'm about to get one. So, I'm going to unbox this and see how this goes. And they give you some test flavors in here before you buy them. So, I'm going to try to open this up and look into this and put it in my coffee area. So, no, I don't need nothing else over here in this area. So, let's unbox this and see how this goes. I would have never put the caramel macchiato creamer in yet just so I could see how the coffee tastes because it came out looking like it already had everything you need. You don't even need to add nothing. So I did learn though with the Nespresso, I guess I wasn't paying attention to Jenny Jacks, but um, each pod tells you what size. So I think I picked one of the smaller ones and the flavor, don't mind my hair y'all, like Today was a rough morning and I need this coffee because it's a busy day. I have um, a bunch of meetings this morning. I don't have to be on camera. Wait, where the pot? Yo, where's the pot? I need to read instructions. I need to read these instructions. Cause where did the pot go? Yes. Help. Okay, one second. Um, I need to read instructions because where did that Nespresso just dispense that pot? Is it somewhere that I need to change it? Oh. Girl, stop. Cure it. You have nothing on Nespresso. It dispenses the pod into this. Bye. I'm keeping this out. Yo. My husband and kids can't touch this. I use Costa Rica. That is, yes. One moment, Gabby, be patient. That's kind of dope. Not even gonna lie, the little thing. So we about to taste this coffee. It's not that bad. 
feels like it's gonna hit the spot. But I wish I would've tasted without the creamer so I can see if I even needed creamer because that's the key to good coffee when you don't even need creamer. You can really just sip it and enjoy the authentic, authentic of the doggone coffee beans. So she has a dermatologist appointment because I wanna show y'all this to see if y'all kid ever got this. And I really do think, let me see your ear. Look at that on her ear. So I think what happened was when we got her ears pierced, my husband wanted her to have real diamonds in her ear. The place we went to was a, it's a known jewelry store and they said that they cannot pierce with diamond earrings like they have to use the the like the wrapping of the earring is is 14 karat gold but the stud inside of it is cubic cubic zirconian i think i'm saying it right the ghetto in me might come out um so um i think that her skin was allergic to that I think that's what it is. And um, so we just switched out her earrings and put her some really, really expensive, but real earrings in her ear. But I think that, I think it's just a fluid, like it's a pimple kind of. So I made her a dermatologist appointment. And um, we gonna see what they say. But so far y'all, Oh shoot, I'm two minutes late. So far y'all, the coffee, I say nine out of 10. Cause it got like a, a bitter to it that I'm not a fan of, but I just gotta get used to it. So once I get used to it, I think it'll be a 10 out of 10. So I'll let y'all know, I'll check in with y'all midday to let y'all know if Jenny Jacks got something going here. Nespresso, y'all better, y'all better sponsor that girl. Cause this, this right here, and the Nespresso's are equivalent to like the Keurig's, like how much some of the Keurig's cost. And I don't even think I got the greatest Nespresso one. Like, I don't know, I'm gonna link the one that I got down below. I don't know which one Jenny Jacks got. I'll try to see if I can get like, cause she usually does montages in the uh, beginning of her videos with it. So I'll try to put like a clip of hers of what she has and then y'all go over and subscribe to her channel and see what she got going on over there because this is the best buy of 2023 right now to me yeah okay bye hi it's the next day i'm sorry whatever day it is it's may 24th it's a wednesday or thursday i don't know but I just want to say that we're on our way because my husband got Gabby's, um, my husband got Gabby's, uh, dresser up in her room. Let me put y'all right here. I feel like, yeah, my, okay. My husband got Gabby's dresser up, um, in her room. So I am going, I was going to get the mirror that I showed y'all from, uh, Pottery Barn, but the mirror that Pottery Barn had, they didn't have like hearts, how I'm doing her room. It was like some flowers, like sunflowers, pink sunflowers. And I don't think that it would just go with what I'm trying to do. So I am, I guess I'll put y'all right here. I am going to see if I could just find a nice like square, I mean straight bottom arch top mirror to put above her dresser or a nice bronze gold color and see how that looks on top of it. Yo, it's your sign, girl, it's so fine, and I would do whatever. No time, no shit. 
shot is what you coming with, but I'ma change all that. Pick your brains, Dad. Put you in the brains, all black. With the rims to match, phone attached, TVs in the back. How you gon' say no to that, huh? Niggas look at me like, man, here you go. Really about to blow some dough. Ain't nobody did fuck so why is you so go home? It's not believe this was meant to be. I just gotta work at it like a crack addict up in rehab. Okay, it's a media console day. And I don't know why my camera, what is happening? Hey, media console day. We get it. So I'm about to clean up this area, move this stuff around. I don't know why it's so bright in here. Um, and figure this out. I think once I get the media console in, then I can go off of how I'm gonna do this area and um, the, the sconces that I want and then the, the window treatment. I think that we might just go ahead. We gotta figure out a window treatment. Cause I think that's what's missing. And also too, with my kitchen, I think what's missing as well is paint. Because we got the base paint color, I think that's what's throwing me off making me feel icky but we shall see so let's get they just called and said they're on their way so I'm about to vacuum clean up the area where it needs to go and then it's gonna be reveal time So now I kind of know, you know, where I want to put the sconces at on the side of the TV with it. And then I had, I think I want to do a pedestal over here or find a planter to raise this up or I might have to get like a six foot tree. I don't know what I want to do, but this is not permanent. That is temporary. So this is how I got the living room set up. So... I had these chairs pulled up, turned the table, I got the couch like this. So it opened the room up more <laughs> to where it gives it a really good conversations piece. So I think what's gonna happen is that once I start adding the decor, I think that I wanna go and grab that picture that I found at Home Goods and try it out here and see how it looks. 
I like the chairs away from the wall and how it's wrapped on the camera around. So I'm gonna probably get some pillows right there, right there and right there. And then we'll kind of do a minimalist type decor in that area. And then last, well, almost second to last, the window treatment will be going in for all of the windows downstairs. But the last thing will be the rug. And that's what I need to get. So let me know your thoughts of what I'm adding here. Um, I think in the next vlog, we are going to try and play with some decor up there and some decor on the coffee table. So basically my whole house, I took all of my decorations down, all my decor, home decor stuff, and I want to put it up and see what I have, what I need to get, and what is left. So I really do love this furniture piece from Crate and Barrel. They do have it in the smaller size. So, and I think I, I don't know if I said it in this vlog yet, but just a recap, cause I'm ending it here, is that this couch is probably gonna go upstairs in the game room. I found a couch on Crate and Barrel that I like is the Gather Collection. That is a sectional and then it kind of have the um, ottoman hanging right there. It, it's not a two seater, it's just one. And then we are taking our floors and ripping this carpet out and doing this all hardwood. And what else? Oh, this coffee table probably go over in the sunroom and I'm gonna do a round. So as of right now, this is what it's gonna be for now. But until we get the, the floor done, the wood no treatment up, and the couch said it won't be here until August, I think. And then this, um, I ordered this piece over here and this, it won't be here till beginning of August as well. So everything has been ordered and I was just waiting game. So I look crazy y'all, but we about to head down to the boat for Memorial Day weekend. So I'm gonna close this vlog out, get this out to you guys. If you're not already doing so, hit that subscribe button, turn those notifications on so you never miss an upload. Make sure you follow me on Instagram at Avianda Latisse and our couples page, Smith 2.0. Sorry for my kids being all loud in the background. I hope y'all have a safe, happy Memorial Day holiday. Be safe y'all, bye.